my research focuses on microbial ecology and the soil processes that are important to soil sustainability. Agriculture in warm and humid climate has been challenged by the rapid degradation of soil and the matter, and therefore the lower capability of soil carbon sequestration. Biochar amendment is a promising approach to enhance soil carbon, but the results are often mixed due to varying properties of biochar, such as surface area, uh, canyon chip capacity, cross size. The overall goal of this project is to understand how biochar amendment affects the soil microbial activity, soil chemical physical properties, and their interactions to help capture and hold soil carbon. We will compare biochar impact on carbon sequestration on different kinds of soils. We look at the cost texture soil, such as the sandy soil. We look at the fine texture soil, such as silky clay loam soil. And then we look at the, the usually called good soil, loamy soil, to see how the biochar works on different soils. And we expect the biochar impact differ on very well soil uh, textures. In North Carolina, we have a lot of sandy uh, cost texture soils. And the cost texture soils, due to lower surface area and the larger pore size, and uh, cannot protect the organic matter from microbial attack. So, if we use a biochar as a amendment, because the biochar has a large surface area, cannot tune capacity, small pore distribution, that's add together will help protect the organic matter from a, a microbial attack. So for today's trial, we're going to use uh, pine wood chips at 20 liters per minute of airflow. So the reason that we use a small scale reactor like this is we can control the reaction conditions. We ignite the biomass from the top and the reaction goes from the top to the bottom. So in the whole process, then biochar is made. So when we ignite it at the beginning, it's going to generate some smoke. So the airflow controls uh, the reaction rate. The oxygen is important, it controls the reaction temperature, and the temperature affects uh, the biochar uh, properties or quality. So wood chips is a very good material for biochar production, okay? And then the second material we're going to use is rice hulls. Rice hulls is an agriculture byproduct. Uh, it has very high biochar yield. We are going to conduct experiments that include several types of biochar and their uh, derivatives such as the compost to examine carbon stabilization in soil and uh, greenhouse gas emissions. So daily we will measure carbon dioxide and the nitrous oxide involved and periodically after finishing uh, greenhouse gas emissions we will take a soil sample to measure soil properties. We hope that the knowledge gained from this project will help to find the important property of biochar that can help uh, carbon sequestration. So we will give the information to the extension personnel to let them craft their biochar properties to improve carbon sequestration in the soil. We've been publishing uh, uh, several papers regarding biochar and the biochar impact on greenhouse gas emission. And I hope uh, the scientists around the world can use uh, all our funding fundings to continue their work to look at uh, carbon sequestration.